Hello students, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, we are going to see exercise 4.1. Okay, first problem. By comparing the ratios A1 by A2, B1 by B2, C1 by C2, find out whether the lines represented by the following pairs of linear equations intersect at a point or parallel or coincident. Okay, so here lines are they gave no we have to tell whether these lines are intersecting or parallel or coincident based on these ratios okay so just this is the given problem so write first equation 5x minus 4y plus 8 is equal to 0 just compare this with a1x plus b1y plus c1 is equal to 0. Okay. And similarly, write second equation 7x plus 6y minus 9 equals to 0. Why we are comparing with this equation? Because the general form of linear equation in two variable is a1x plus b1y plus c1. Okay, so here a2x plus b2y plus c2 is equal to 0. Now, just write a1. a1 is nothing but the coefficient of x, 5 and b1 coefficient of y. Sorry, here a1 is nothing but the coefficient of x. Okay, b1 coefficient of y minus 4 c1 8 now a2 7 b2 6 c2 minus 9 now just calculate a1 by a2 so a1 5 a2 7 similarly b1 by b2 minus 4 by 6. If we cancel 2 2's and 2 3's, it is minus 2 by 3. Now C1 by C2, it is 8 by minus 9, that is minus 8 by 9. So we got. Now from the observation, we can write A1 by A2 is not equals to B1 by B2. So, a1 by a2 not equals to b1 by b2 means these two lines are intersecting lines. Therefore, the given lines are intersecting lines. If a1 by a2 is not equals to b1 by b2, the two lines are intersecting lines. Okay. And they are consistent also. Intersecting line means they have only one solution. If solution is there, that is consistent and consistent. Okay. So, this is second problem. So, just compare the first equation with a1x plus b1y plus c1 is equal to 0. And second equation 18x plus 6y plus 24 is equal to 0. a2x plus b2y plus c2 is equal to 0. So, write a1 a1 equals to 9, B1 equals to 3, C1 equals to 12 and here A2 equals to 18, B2 6, C2 24. See, 9 twos are 18, 3 twos are 6, 12 twos are 24. That means all the ratios are equal. 
so 1 by 2 b1 by b2 also 1 by 2 c1 by c2 also 1 by 2 okay so finally what we can we write a1 by a2 equals to b1 by b2 equals to c1 by c2 so the two lines are coincident lines okay the two lines are coincident lines coincident line means they have infinite number of solutions okay they have infinite solutions and inconsistent inconsistent sorry consistent only solution is there no so consistent okay actually here in the problem they are not asking whether they are cons consistent or inconsistent but we are telling okay sometimes in the exam they may ask whether the given equations are consistent or inconsistent if they have solution Okay, solution unna or many solutions unna gaani consistent. Third problem, 6x minus 3y plus 10 equals to 0. So, after comparing with a1x, b1y plus c1, we wrote a1, b1, c1. Similarly, second equation also, a2, b2, c2. a1 by a2, 3. b1 by b2 also 3. Minus 3 by minus 1. Minus minus will get cancelled. 3. c1 by c2, 10 by 9. So, here a1 by a2 is equals to b1 by b2, not equals to c1 by c2. So, the given two lines are parallel. They have no solution and inconsistent. No solution means they are inconsistent. Please like this video and share with your friends and please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.